Hello everyone, in this video we will see how to register for NEPTEL exam. So here I have opened the email required. So here you can read all of this thing. I will just scroll slowly so that you can go through it in your pace. Okay. So just go through it. Okay. These are the list of courses you can get in your email, the courses which are offered and the courses which are uh, able to give you credits, like uh, which are eligible for credit transfer. Okay. So just read through this. These are the important points. We will uh, refer all this point and do our NAPTEL registration. And I will give you, you a overall guide and overall I will make you navigate to the interfaces so you will be comfortable while doing yours and you won't be calling your friend again and again and you won't be depending upon your friend so before that uh this time i'm i'm doing a wildlife and ecology course and uh, for other because it was just like forest uh management you can see this neptil uh video of mine to get more information upon forest and management or wildlife course which i recommend for this year this semester okay and uh, you can see this fire exam guide as well the, the wildlife ecology course is just similar to forest as i have discovered with senior so let's do that okay so first of all i have got this wildlife and ecology subject which was eligible for credit transfer and i have also written the uh, course code and i just uh, paste it or uh, in your search engine and I got this one. So just click over it. It is Neptel, which is uh, also known as Swam Neptel. So just, when you will click over it, you will be navigated to that uh, page where you can see about this course, uh, 12 weeks and all those stuff. Okay. And he is the professor of this course and other things you can get to, uh, you know, from this page. So after this, uh, after coming to the page, uh, you have to click uh, join. Uh, since I have already joined, it is not showing for me. And uh, if you are a beginner, uh, you have to just create a new account using your VIT email ID. And uh, the point we are following here is this one, uh, VIT email ID. You have to put a registration number and you have to ensure all these points. Okay. You have to fill student and all those stuff. So just read through it and I will navigate uh, to it uh, very briefly. So after do, uh, coming here, uh, it, because it is the easiest way possible to get to that page exactly. Okay. So when you come here, you come to this page and now you just click join. It will be in, uh, join before you actually join. So you just click join. There will be a lot of information which you have to fill and you have to read this instruction as well I, I guess the this is the next navigation page they will tell you the exam date and uh, for this time it is coming around the wali vacations and you have to click here to go to actually register for that course okay and then you have to select city and all those information you have to read here and i will just go to next interface which we will be facing so you will be coming to a interface like this and uh, yeah uh, exam dashboard and personal information and all those stuff you have to fill that and then courses and uh, all those cities so uh, by filling all this information you will be getting uh, you know uh, after after filling all those information you have to add the course and after you add the course you have to select the city and then pay pay for it uh, for as of now uh, those who don't know the preference here you know, if we're giving that exam in Chennai only like if you uh, decide to give that exam and then go to your vacation holidays to your hometown or something so you can uh, fill this preference order like uh, this thing so uh, since our college VIT Chennai is in Chennai South so you can just put it and uh, our college pink code is this one and then uh, the preference like this you can just uh, choose and then you have to review and finish off payment and uh, you can just see if it is successfully registered or not and uh, the information which you will be uh, needing is uh, like you know uh, you have to put this apart by academic bank of credit information as you know 
uh, you don't have it okay and credit transfer you have you want to do uh, and uh, you, you can sh uh, you want to share your score with the college and you know um b tech degrees b tech or whatever you are, you are doing um, and then college issue name co will come like this and so the other information let me show you Mm, college pin code college uh, is located in chingal to district okay and you have to put student as per the email you have to put this uh, as your highest qualification because before college this is the highest qualification and you have to put this i don't have abc id that is um, academic bank of trade abc okay and you have to put this yes and uh, your call vd chennai uh, college will look the, something like this Chennai comes here, but here uh, Vellore well comes, okay, uh, in college name and uh, university name and your degree looks like this, department and stuff, okay. So, that's all, you have to pay and uh, get uh, register and yeah, that's all for today's video, I will see you next time, have a great day. The new thing I want to point out is after you register successfully, you have to print that receipt and save a safely for future reference and for each particular branch there is a uh, google form uh, which you have to fill before a deadline to actually be eligible for credit transfer so for for cac it is 12 july uh, cac core basically it is 12 july 2024 you have to before that you have to pay to the neptel uh, although neptel's last date of payment was august 12 uh, but you have uh, but since they want the screenshot of payment in the google form you have to pay it before 12 july and uh, you have to fill this google form to ensure that uh, you will be eligible for credit transfer after you complete the NAPTEL course so that's it see you next time